How did the song originate? Just take us down there. How did how did it originate? I wrote the song. We wrote the song. We wrote the the hook and 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 a lot of the, the the inlay for the song, but we didn't have a track for it. Finally, we got a track for it. Laid the song down, kind of mulled around the song in Atlanta for a little while. Finally, the radio station, one of the DJs at the radio station heard it. Took it to the radio station. It was one of the biggest hits ever in Atlanta. I mean, everybody know that, you know, dude tried to do what he did with, with, with yeah. the song and, you know, Jermaine did what he did with the song, but it's like, hey, they never, once the song got to number one, we did a cease and desist. I mean, literally stop hearing that song. Facts. I mean, you could, you could Google it. Yeah, what you mean, right. what you mean you stop hearing it? Cease and desist mean that yeah, you have to stop even yeah. playing this. This is every radio station, yeah. everywhere on earth. Once you, once my, once our lawyer saw that it went number one, and it's totally real. Our song was number one, and Banner's song was number two, and he called us. You know, when you knew when a song goes number one, your lawyer called you with, oh, all happy. Yeah, this wasn't one of them calls. He called us all sad. We you know what we got to do. Do it. Cause this is just crazy. But you don't hear that song. You still don't hear that song on the radio. Do you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you hear our version of it because our version is the real version of it. Yeah, the original. But what I'm saying is you don't hear that song on a national level. You don't go places and say, oh, they, cause it's season this is on it. Like that's a court order. Who was on the original song? The original song was me, Reese, Bone Crusher, and Killer Mike. T.I. came in and did his verse, but we couldn't pay him at the time. Like, literally, it wasn't, I mean, T.I. wasn't T.I. at the time. He was Tip. Yeah, because that song is what really broke him, right? I mean, mm -hmm. but he didn't get paid for it, but yeah. it made his career. Killer Mike, we paid Killer Mike, but he didn't get paid for the song from Bone, but it made his career. I mean, a season this is killed him. You know, yeah. Bone didn't do a damn thing because you couldn't perform it. Go ahead. Do it. And a season desist on this. I mean, that is a court order. So, I mean, go back and, 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 and like I said, it's a Googleable fact. It's nothing I made up. <laughs> you yeah. know what I'm saying? So, it hurt, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, so Boosie did head. an interview, right? Right. And Boosie said, uh, and we that didn't ain't, ask that him. ain't that ain't that ain't that ain't his song. And we didn't ask him. That, that's recent big song out of Jackson, Mississippi. Because it's the truth. We did not ask Boost Boosted. And and this is a fact. I mean, you can ask Boosted himself. We didn't ask Boosted to do that. We didn't and there were certain people in the game that we asked to do it. Because they knew the truth. Mm -hmm. And they wouldn't. This was a dude, this was the first dude to say it out loud. We didn't even ask him to do that because he knew it was the truth. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. it's, 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 it's amazing that it, that, that it took somebody outside of every and, – and not saying I didn't know Boosie. Boosie cool, as, that was my dog. But I didn't ask him to do it. The one that we asked to do it wouldn't do it. And mm. he knew the truth. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. that just shows you how real that dude is. But yeah, it's the truth. It's, I mean, I, I mean, I don't have no reason to lie about it. You know what I'm saying? It's been 20 years ago. I have no reason to continue with a lie. Yeah. <laughs> no, real shit. That's like, I, like, it's, it amazes me that this dude continuously lies to himself every day or every time he get on the mic and tell people about this song, he is literally lying to himself, man. I mean, just imagine. Could you live Could you live a lie? No, nah, no. Nah. Feel me? Like, your whole existence is a lie. That got to do something to a man. Was y'all friends? Like, did y'all did you know him? I'm just going to be honest. Oh, my God. Yeah. I mean... 
the man would come down, we would treat the man like family. I mean, come to the house, eat. I mean, we was big guys at the time. You know, your sister tell you, we were big guys at the time. So anything I had in my closet was fair game. Just go get that shit, I don't give a fuck. Like, we treated that dude like family. Yeah. You know, that's what hurt so bad. His kids called me Uncle Big. Yeah. Damn. You know, it's bigger than rap. You know what I'm saying? And people don't even, you know, people looking at the rap part of, I would have killed that nigga, da 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 and blah, 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 blah. If I would have killed that nigga, they knew it was me. And Reese and what, they, what the dude name? Lee Harvey Oswald. I would have been a legend. Oh, nigga, that shit would have been like, y'all would have been in here doing, the, and they'd have been brought that shit up in your big load. Yeah, man, they killed bone crush and shit. You remember that shit? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga, they still do a time, yeah, and that's it, man. Nah, you know, I'm just not stupid. Yeah. But uh, it's tragic because he killed two careers. Yeah. You know, we, we could have been millionaires together, but. Some people don't see the team aspect of it. They want to be Michael Jordan and they Scottie Pippen. Yeah. So I guess the people want to know, like, it's still going, going, like what? We still suing this dude. Like, it's, it, they bringing it back up more and more. I've had several calls from Def Jam. I've had several calls from people in Atlanta. And we had a talk about this the other day. You know what I'm saying? Now they don't like uh, Jermaine Dupree, and they think that I'm going to get in the middle of that, and I'm not. You know, you're not going to treat me like a pawn in somebody's game, you know what I'm saying? If 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 I just want I just want the, I just want my money. You know what I'm saying? All the money is in escrow. You know what I'm saying? None of the money's been spent. None of that. It's just I, I just want my money. I don't want to be in no limelight. I don't want to be in no news. None of that. You know, just be real. Yeah. Cause in an interview Boots said uh Boots said uh y'all stop rapping because of it. We 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 didn't stop rapping, but we stopped being as diligent with it. You know what I'm saying? Because life goes on. Yeah. You know, the only thing that's, that's constant in life is change. If you don't reinvent yourself and you know you have to reinvent yourself, something wrong with you. You know what I'm saying? If you want to live in 1995, then live in 1995, but I want to live in 2022. Yeah. So I kept reinventing myself. Like right now, I'm Chef Bigelow, and that's what I do for a living. I cook. And you can hate it as long as you want to, but you ain't going to hate my food. Yeah. So y'all kept going. Kept going. Reese is a nurse. I mean, Reese ran a hospital. And he did it on a bet. We bet him he couldn't finish nursing school. Yeah. And he did it. Like, damn. But he on a bet. Yeah. That was on a bet. Like, yeah. you can't finish nursing school, nigga. What, nigga, what? And literally. Yeah. You think y'all were blackballed after that? Was it like a? Jermaine Dupree was big then. Yeah. I mean, yeah. But we, like I said, I still do shows off Never Skate. I just did a couple shows off Never Skate. I never stopped doing shows. We never stopped getting paid off Never Skate. That's the thing. See, what a lot of people don't see is they they don't see the the residual that's going on. They don't. They just like man, them niggas just fucked up. And just, I'm good. Yeah. Don't think that I ain't good. I still get 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 uh Roy. I own everything. Yeah. My shit is on the internet and all that. I own my shit. My shit is on Apple Music and everything. I own my shit. I still get a check for that shit. So don't think that I'm over here fucked up. I'm straight. Shit. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, that was unfortunate that Never Scared happened like that, but I please believe I'm straight. I ain't stupid enough to not put my shit on Apple Music and get a dollar a piece for it. I'm not stupid enough to not put my shit on YouTube and whatever change they're going to give me for it, it come. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. 